Welcome! Episode 109! Feed the Beast, Longo Mongo. We're gonna have some fun right now. Yes, we are. As you can see, I have taken the liberty of rebuilding some tools. Uh, right, let's, uh, actually, I went, I went down and got some, some more lava for the geothermal generator. Uh, so what do you guys think of this amazing mess I made? See, made the room right here. Every other block's got a half slab on the top, so it, uh, Spi speeders can't be getting in here. Don't need none of them speeder men interrupting my day. Throw that in the furnace. Generator. Macerator. Now I'm going to throw a stack in the mass hole rator also. Because that will give us sand. We can use sand for other things. Okay, so we got the uh, ladders. Let's put this other stuff away. Now let me show you what we do with these. These then they are here ladders. All right. Yeah. And then, whoop. And we we miss. I did terraform this a little. Made it a nice even, gentle slope. So I'm gonna get rid of this little bit here. And then. Do it up proper. Get up this tree. Need to hop down a little. Then I could just make a lookout or a post up here, but unfortunately this tree is in the way of progress. So Woodsy, you're out. And I learned a cool new trick today. So I can't wait to do that. If I need it, oh, that ladder went up too high. And thank you, C418, for the wonderful music. Nice lumberjacking, relaxing music. Slice of the world. Got one geyser over there. We got another geyser over there. Wow, that seems. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. We're gonna just turn that off for now. And here we go. Lumber yakking. <laughs> You guys notice the fact that I just turned the music off, but we can still hear it vaguely. It's like, nope, gotta finish this song. And the band played until the Titanic sank. And this is where you guys all get to get dizzy watching me spin in circles. So, Walking Dead was on last night, but I was at work, so I get to watch that. Want to get around to it? I can't wait to watch the new episode. You know, now that everyone, you know, Rick's gone completely off the rails. A new member of the party. And One of my friends was telling me watching Walking Dead is like watching a, almost like watching a bad uh, RPG being played out live action. 
which I thought was kind of funny. See, I'm still wondering why my actual Windows mouse cursor keeps popping up. I mean, I did take one of the tips for uh, recording while playing Feed the Beast was to, uh, to close the console that loads up when you open up Feed the Beast. So I've done that. And yes, it does run a little smoother. I mean, I did wait for the game to completely load up. Load up the map. Get everything going. <sighs> this is a lot of wood. Old growth forest. And there we have it. The majestic giant tree is no more. Alright, let's do the proper thing. Bow your heads in a moment of silence for the tree. Thank you. That was a pretty tree. Shame that I wanted to removed for my selfish imperialistic industrial needs but I did and I did remove it see now we get all these saplings oh I didn't show you guys one of the things I was doing see saplings are floating right over to me Yeah, see, I turned the magnet mode on. I was going to show you guys that beforehand. Dang it, I forgot to do that. See, you, I turned on utility mode. Turned on magnet mode. That way, as I'm doing this, see, watch. See, just flew right over. Fine, you know, once you're close enough. Okay, so... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's gotta be an odd number. Only works if it's an odd number. See? Now all I gotta do is just stand here doing what I'm gonna do. And it keeps flying to me. Okay, so if that's one, two, uh, <laughs> you know what? Let's use the wood as a temporary one two three four five six seven so one two one two three three hmm Miss clicking champion of the world, Uncle Mongo. Investing in a bunch of stone. All right, let's put that one there. You there. So then that will be one, two, three. That way. No. Nope. That'll be one that way. Doing that to there. Hmm. No, oh, 
could do. As you guys know, I like my towers. <clears throat> Well, obviously, it's not going to match up with that spot there, because that would, that's way the heck over here. Of course, I could just make a diagonal bridge. Why not? going down. Don't let the sun go down. Okay, so we got three, two, one, two. can hear that cat in the background snoring. Yes, that sound in the background is a cat snoring. Hmm. I'm going to put that there and see what happens. going to use that for the layout. So that means we're going to need a bunch of bunch of stone. And that will be my way to get back and forth. From the Mad Cave of Doom. Actually, the tower over there will eventually be my home. I'll live over there and do all the other stuff in here. Uh, I like the sound of that. All right. Keeping the saplings in there. Uh, but all wood in here. Whoops. Whoops. Oh, come on. Oh, I hear you. So now that I've moved everything around in here, I need to, well, continue to move everything around in here. Okay, I even built this over that way. Here's the, the original idea for this, the concept for this was to be a rail. That'll be the return rail that comes up and stops up here someplace. Just not too incredibly sure where, when, why, how, etc. Uh, let's make some glass. Oh, furnace is getting low. Uh, stone goes in there. Let's grab a couple more potatoes. Uh, Did I have a second iron pickaxe? <coughs> What did I just do with that other pickaxe? Man, am I totally losing it? Did I just chuck an iron pickaxe someplace and not notice? Wow. Brilliant. Well, we need to find some more lava for our 
geothermal generator. So, um, heck with it. One, two, three, four. I can't believe I'm using the uh, iron already. You always need redstone, so grab that one down here. So I need to make an enchanting table as, as well, because there's just some things that, you know, if I can get me a fortune three pickaxe for when I want to do a, a extracting of diamonds, for instance, I'd rather have the fortune three pickaxe. One, two, three. So we're listening for a lava source. We're trying to stick to our pattern, which is apparently not working too well. Now I started going the other way too. Let's check this out. I'm gonna run out of uh, torches. Oh wow, I dug this one pretty far. I think I dug this one a lot further than I've dug any of the other ones. Heck with it. Alright, since I've taken this one to the extreme, let's keep going. See how the the blocks are falling way back there? And just, whoop, come right over to me. Huh. These little pockets, see like this was just a little pocket I found. So I'm wondering what was there that's not there because... You know, something didn't load, or something loaded, or, you know, so I was wondering what's going on with that. Woohoo, back up to level one. Yay, and the crowd went wild. Yar. And Snagglepuss said hello. This is why I want a fortune pickaxe. Really, two diamonds. See, it's a little cove. See, that's why you keep digging when you find stuff. Clear out the area around it. So that's four diamonds. Oh, and just so. Just, because I'm going to use them when I get there, but just so you guys know, here, I'll even show you real quick. Uh, P-I-P-E. I have grabbed the additional pipes, because now I like my teleport pipes, but then, now they're phase pipes. But as you see, they are expensive. They take a diamond gear and glass. But I really like how these things work, and i going to... Oh, wow, they only make four now, not eight? Holy crap! That is ridiculously expensive. <sighs> All right, but yeah, once you once you get teleport pipes or phase pipes is that they're being called now, um, it makes long distance stuffage a lot easier. I can just go pump from the geyser back home <clears throat> and yeah why didn't I put torches down there I knew that was gonna happen so anyway that's additional pipes I did go ahead and grab that and throw it in here. And I still haven't seen any um, any more lava, 
which is a potential problem. So we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and call that an episode. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. I hope you all have a beautiful evening, a wonderful day. Happy Easter. No, it's Thanksgiving. I was thinking about having some fun in my videos doing something like, Hey guys, uh, well, uh, as you see, they just re-elected President Bush. I can't believe they've done that. Time stream. Oh well. It's all just a stream of consciousness anyway. I hope you all enjoyed the video. I'll be back later. Have fun. Bye-bye.